Hi right, you two, this is Bayo here. I know that we are in the spring now, second day I believe, or third day. But uh, this is something that uh, is needed at home. Uh, this is the new uh, APG Outdoor Radiant Heater, which is basically the Korean design or the US version of it. This is the one that uh, I use in the restaurant during winter time because uh, it's very easy to light up. First of all, you have to, you know, put it on a little bit, and uh, you hear the uh, wait a few seconds and it fires back up. You have to keep it. You have to keep the uh, push it down until it ignites all the way. Okay, you see how big it is with with, with the one pound bottle now. This is the uh, Chinese manufacturer of the uh, Kobia here. Uh, as long as they are not the same, nobody can complain. I told you about that last time. So this is very close to the Kobia, which is Korean company that is the brains in Asia when it comes to uh, this type of fuel. <laughs> okay, this is the one pound. Brunton is made by who? US, I don't remember. Okay, but this is basically designed to be placed over here. And then I have the uh, the plastic leg, so that will help with this stabilizing of the bottle. So, so this is one pound, and, and the US is open, see? So you close it. And now you have it. US, Asian. Look at the big difference. One, the legs are over here, so they're a little bit, uh, just like the uh, the stuff they use uh, for cooking too. It's the same, same kind of leg. See now, uh, the price of this is $34 plus, you know, taxes that they charge over here and then Two dollars for fast transportation comes from China, so it gets here uh, quicker than the continental U.S. mail. Uh, let me show you the label that you might. It has it come with a little uh, black bag to put it in your backpack. Here are the legs. You know, standard small. Uh, okay, see, it fits right here. And then you move it up and down, and mambo jumbo. Yeah? Almost you see how fast it is. Now that more stable. Okay. So basically, um, this is much cheaper than the uh, body. Uh, you was made. Uh, what is it? Uh, my body heater. And uh, you can take it with you. You can put it inside a tank. You can put it in a corner in the room. But of course. You have to have somebody watching it 24-7. Okay, uh, I'm not supposed to be running inside the house. No heater is supposed to be inside right the house because of the CO2, plain and simple. Now, put this aside. <clears throat> we have to do this in two, uh, two parts because uh, we have a little issue with technology. Even though the technology got replaced but it's not ready up to par. So this is the Stamper company, a US company, of course, uh, everything else is made in China. The T connector. This is a T connector, guys. Now, why do I mention this T connector? Uh, people that don't have the money to buy the good stuff, you know, it, it goes in the world, you buy a three cylinder car, or you got a motorcycle car like in India, a tattoo, nano car, and it's the purpose, point A to point B, so this one right here, I don't know who invented it, but it basically goes in the five pound bottle of gas, okay? Right there. And then, what's the deal? You can get an adapter, like any other adapter that they sells in the uh, ancient world, in the ancient world. I lost to the one. Uh, right here. 
Now, this is this is Chinese copy. This is a Covia, the original one. You see the Covia have a little little bowl in the middle that I touch to regulate the amount of gas. Now, listen to this. Now, listen to the sound. This is much heavy metal, Korean, of course. So you just put this tension over here, the adapter, to run the, to run the uh, Asian kind of equipment, not US, but Asian. And then, basically becomes like this, uh, one pound, now you have five pounds. And basically it's the same principle. And this one, you can take it to a garage, you can take it to your room, you can take it anywhere. Now, Stamport, the T, T connector, Stamport, guess where I found it? You won't believe me. Uh, McD uh, McDonald's, brain dead. Uh, Woody World, Walmart. So now, you're using your heater, and you have uh, another port to use your stove or to use, uh, what else, or maybe a light, you know, one of those new lights that are coming into the market. Uh, or you can leave it in the room in the corner to heat up inside your house. Of course, you have to have ventilation. Of course, you have to have the CO2 uh, detector and all the stuff. Just like a lot of people use this type in the little travel trailer, okay? So um, this is going to be short and sweet. It's going to be a second part so I can test this. I'm going to take it outside. I already tested it in the house, but I know some of you guys. Oh, it's going to blow up and kill by you. No, don't worry about it. If you follow the instructions, nothing's going to happen. Okay, remember, uh, get you a small bottle. Or get you the one pound. Or get the U.S. big crap like this. The uh, Coleman. Uh, I know you can refill this. Okay, so um, I'll talk to you later. In the next round, you will have the second part and see how it works. This is hot. Better than my uh, DynaGlow uh, uh, so-called in-house heater. And if you regulate it perfectly, it's not going to, this five pound will last you probably five to seven days. It depends on how you regulate it and how many hours you use it. Okay, guys. Short and sweet. Talk to you later. Behave.